I sat down with Aaron Sullivan from the Orange County Public Library System. Here's that conversation. Aaron Sullivan with the Orange County Library System is joining us now. Thank you for being here. Thank you for having me it's today. It's great to see you. So chances are there's a library very close to you if you live in the Orange County area. And there are a lot of things that maybe people don't realize that they can get access to at their local library. Yes, we have 15 locations in Orange County, so we try to have a library relatively convenient to everyone who lives in, this, in the county. And we're looking to add two more. We have one coming in Horizon West, one coming in Lake Nona soon, so there'll be even more libraries soon. And there is a lot at the library that people have no idea. Um, I like to tell people a lot, we have books, obviously, mm -hmm. but we also have eBooks and audiobooks. And I like to talk about this because a lot of people pay for services like audible.com, and they'll pay $15, $20 yeah. a month to get audiobooks, but you can usually get the same exact titles through the library with your library card for free. That I had no idea that you could do, which is fantastic because it is, we're so on the go and those are the things that we're using these days. So all people have to do is come get a library card and they can sign up? Absolutely. So you get a library card, there's an app that you can download to your smartphone or your tablet, or you can also put books on your Kindle, whatever you like to read on, we make it accessible to you. Get on our website, pick what you want, download it, and you're ready to go. That's fantastic. There's also a lot of great opportunities for people people to take advantage at the Melrose Center. So for those of you who maybe haven't been there before, tell us a, a little bit about that. The Melrose Center is fantastic. It is a creative hub, basically, for the community. Everything in there is free to library card holders who take an orientation to be part of the Melrose Center. There's an, a professional audio studio, so if you are interested in either learning audio and how to produce music, you can take classes at the Melrose Center, or if you already know and can show us that you're proficient with the equipment, you can use it to record your own music music, record albums. We've got editing software, we've got a mixing board. It is a professional level, amazing studio. There's also a video studio with similar you know, qualifications. You show us, you can use it, and you can check it out and use it just like you would any other library resource. There's a photo studio, there's podcasting booths, and there are computers loaded with Creative Cloud software. So you can come in and you can work on your creative project and on your own time, and just take advantage of what we have without having to purchase it yourself. That has to be very popular. It it is very popular. We all often hear that people don't know about it though, so I like to talk about it because I would love for people to come in and use it because it's a fantastic resource and not many libraries can say that they have that level of material for people. Yeah, great access for people for sure. Yeah, it's awesome. And there's also great resources that people can get at the library system. Social services, for example, is something that you offer. Correct. So libraries are a great place for people who are struggling with issues and they need more information or help uh, to get where they need to be. So a lot of people think about education but we also have social workers on site at multiple branches that are available on a first come first serve basis. So if you need help with career counseling, if you need help with uh, finding an apartment or getting SNAP benefits, we do have social workers that you can come in and take advantage of for free and they'll help you with applications, help you find resources, help you connect with things that you may not even know exist that you're eligible for. That's wonderful. Erin, thank you so much for coming by and talking with us. It was thank great you. to see you. Yeah, it was a pleasure. Go get your library card. There are so many wonderful things that you can take advantage of at your local library.